Hello everyone, welcome to KSR Data Vision YouTube channel. In this video, we'll see what are the course update for the month of July. So for that, we have our own LMS portal. So if you are logging for the first time, please go to this website, datavision.com. And here you will have an option to sign up. If you're a first time sign up user, please give your email ID and give your OTP that will be coming as a verification. And once that is created, you can always go and log in with your email ID. And here I'll try to log in with the student account and I'll show you how it looks like. So once you create the account, you will be logging in and this is uh, exactly the same dashboard which you'll be seeing from the student account perspective. So this is a main dashboard and uh, here you can go to the explore courses and in the explore courses you can see as a free sessions and these are all the courses that we are starting with respect to july month so if you see here here uh, we have the data analytics with power bi so this is a role where you will be doing end-to-end -end reports. We are starting this session from July 21st, which is on Monday. So this will be the evening batch, which is 8 p.m. And so the guys who are like looking for a role where you don't want to uh, have a, a complex functionality, where you want to help the clients to build the dashboards, you can opt for data analytics with Power BI. So here the skill sets that you'll be learning will be SQL, which is very much needed to interact with your database. And then the majority of the course will be with your power bi so power bi is a business intelligence tool you need not need any coding knowledge even if you're coming from a non-coding background you can opt for this so this is data analytics with power bi and here in power bi what we do is we get the data from the different clients and we help them in building the end-to-end -end report so that is one thing and again in the recent times we see a lot of updates uh, every company is moving to the cloud so here we will be learning microsoft azure specifically we'll be focusing on adf and then finally last two years we have a very tremendous growth in terms of updates that is nothing but fabric so data analytics will be a course where you'll be learning four top skills sql power bi fabric and azure this four skills is more than enough for you to crack a job and the company needs all of the skill sets and the primary audience for this is even if you don't have any coding background any no it experience even if you're working in non-it you can definitely opt for this this is the most satisfying role now to get started with again we have uh, another course which is like data science with gen ai like uh, i've been hearing the data science data science data science for the last 15 years and even today i'm saying data science is a king of technologies so with data science what you'll do we have the data we have everything now we start doing some predictions we do some analysis and then we come up with some suggestions improvements we provide them strategies to give it simple let's say that we are running an institute and we have a, a good number of people who are taking up the course but now what's next how can i improve the business right how can i focus on other things so you need to improve the business you need to make money so data science is all about understanding the past predicting the future so here we have the data we'll be given a lot of data for you you will have to analyze you'll have to do all the maybe do some data missing values treat the missing values remove the outlays and then take a decision but the good thing is Data science is also keep on updating every single day. And in the recent days, what we have seen is you would have been experienced with chat, GPT, Copilot, Gemini, a lot of new AI tools have been into picture. And that is what you'll be learning here. So data science with generative AI. In generative AI, we will be learning a lot of algorithms which you can implement for your daily use. So this course will be taken by Koti and it will commerce from 3rd of July and it will be a evening batch. So people who are freshers who want to scale up and people who are experienced who wanted to learn how this AI works, this is a right opportunity for you. This is a six months course, which is going to be the only online and offline in our KSR. So you can visit our office in Bangalore and then you can take an offline class. So this is very much in demand and it's one of the high paying salary. And now we have learned data analytics, we have learned data science. Now for both of these guys, this is very important data engineering so uh, it's fair to say that without data engineers you will not have any other role it's very fair to say that without data engineers you will not see any other role the reason is who are these data engineers data engineers are the guys who are helping the data analyst and data engineers to gather the data right so they will help you to 
pull the data from right sources, gather it, do the data modeling, data cleaning, data transformations, according to the business, apply some logics. So all of this is done by data engineers. Yes, it is a bit tough comparatively, but again, it's worth. It's worth. You'll be learning SQL. Here you will be learning Python and PySpark. These are the two coding frameworks. You will have to learn this in order to make the complex transformations. And once you do all this data cleaning, data transformations, data modeling, you will have to make this data available for data scientists and data analytics. So I would say data engineers are the root. So this is a highest paying job in the current market for the data related subjects. So people who are opting for high package, people are willing to join a good company with a high package. You can opt for it. But again, as I said, it's a bit tough. But it's really worth to learn and here this batch we are going to start on 17th july and the good thing is um, we have added a new update what exactly we have done is once you build the pipelines the companies also expect you to do a deployment to the production and that is why we are also adding data ops as an additional skill to this so once you build the pipeline you will also be building the pipeline into the production so that's a good point for you of course in in the current market you have two guys Data engineer is a one person. DevOps guy is another person who's doing development. But in your case, in this role, we are teaching both so that you can go and do the deployment by yourself. So no need to look for another person in your project. You yourself can do the deployment. So that's about data engineering. Now coming to Power Platform, this is something which I would really want to tell you um, more things here. People who are looking for zero coding platform, people who are looking for zero coding role, so this is a one which will definitely help you in this. What you can do, you'll be building a website. You'll be building a BI reports. You'll be building a power apps. Uh, you'll be building mobile apps or website apps, or you will be building some chatbots. All of this comes under Microsoft Power Platform. So you have almost like five to six tools here. So we'll be learning everything here. And with this, you will be implementing application websites, chatbots and BI reports. So this is a very much in demand for the guys who are also looking for zero coding or a low coding. You can opt for this. You'll have a decent salary with this part platform. So Indrajit is the person who is actually taking this course. So he is an expert in our part platform. So this course is from 24th July uh, from Thursday, which is a morning batch. So you can definitely opt for it. Now talking about the next course here we have DevOps. So as I was talking about DevOps in the DevOps, if you are building a project, you will have to also have a deployment, right? You need to have a deployment. So that is where we'll be focusing on DevOps here. So DevOps is a person who actually follows some of a process and he will be helping the company to deploy the projects. OK, so here we will have to see how this DevOps and the SREs, SREs like site uh, reliability engineering, like how they deploy the process and how they uh, make sure the entire process has been captured step by step. So all of this we will be learning here. And this is a subject where guys who are looking for more of process oriented rather than the technology frameworks or coding, you can opt for DevOps most demand technology because a person who is deploying the project has to have all the process knowledge. So that is where you will be learning this. So this is actually taken by Sean. So it's on 4th July and the beauty of this course is we have opted in such a way that we will be covering uh, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, uh, four days a week so that you will get ample amount of time to be a working professional, work for a company and then also take up your course as flexibility. So this is one which also gives you a high package. And apart from that, wherever you go, Excel is what is needed. So we have an Excel course which is already going on. So you can opt for Excel, which is a 30 days duration. Excel is very handy and you will be able to master that as well. So with this, these are the courses that we will be launching in the month of July. So as per the KSR policy, every single course, you'll be getting five days free session. Please attend, talk to our mentors, ask your questions and choose the right course for you. Apart from that, if you have any questions, you can always contact us and we have a number here and you can call us anytime you can chat with us and we'll get back to you with a response. So thank you so much for watching. We'll meet in the next video.